following along on the secrets for crimp and uh, crimp tubes with loops, have a length of AccuFlex beading wire. I'll place a crimp tube on the end. And using chain nose pliers, I'll compress the center section to capture it and the wire so they are joined. Turn that over just to make sure it's done equally on both sides. And then trim any excess wire that you may have poking out past the end. We're ready to thread on some beads and begin our pattern. And then we'll continue stringing the beads and get that necklace all sewn up. We have the beads all strung and ready to be finished. We'll slide on another crimp end, crimp tube with loop. And before I secure it, what I want to check for is the drape and the flexibility in the wire. Sometimes when you get the beads on too tight, the wire will be a little rigid and not fall with a nice drape. So you want to just make sure there's a little bit of slack between the ends so that the beads are free to move and that you get a really nice uh, motion in your necklace. Once you have that position, we'll secure that end the same way we did in the beginning. Using chain nose pliers, we'll come in and compress, turn it over to make sure that it's secure and compressed evenly on both sides, and then just pull to make sure it's in position and that it'll stay there. And then trim the excess as close to the inside of that end as you can. We'll set this aside. So I've gathered up a few different lengths of chain, copper, gold, and antique brass in color. And on one end, I've gathered them with a jump ring and connected the jump ring to half of the clasp. I've gathered the other end of the chains on a jump ring and now I'll connect it to the loop on one end of our beaded strand. And I'll close the jump ring to secure. And then for the jump ring on the other half of the clasp, we'll open that up, thread on the loop on the other side. Close the jump ring, make sure it's secure and cle close cleanly, and our necklace is complete. We'll take these leftovers, some of our secrets, and head on over to the next project.